The dead man's back. Because All right. This is your, yeah, this is your money from the. Boom. Moon. Look at that. I set you up for success. Now I can look. Oh, wow. Can you, like, use that stuff? Uh, I think this is kind of like the uh, a gallery of all the items in the game. Because, uh, like, there's the health potion, and there's the sword and stuff. Alright, so there's, like, a combo move. Independent legends. Strange book tells of heroes of other worlds. Some of its cryptic sentences seem to provide clues, but for what? Its pages had a blasphemous. Causes flask in your head is causes flask in your head is bad for your health. Okay, I guess. This one's called a hyper light drifter. It tells the tale of a man in a drifter outfit and his reliable sword. Clear's day. Subject here is Hollow Knight. How much can you bounce? Bounce? But how? Guacamole, the story of the savior of the Mexiverse that fought countless undead wrestlers barehanded and footed. I'm always up for a good fight. Curse of the Dead Gods. It says that the seasoned explorer knows not to get hit by those nasty traps once. Who could have thought? In my shield, I like it better than the bow. <clears throat> I haven't mentioned this much, I just stopped and read some of this book. This guy's name. Who are you? I know what you've been up to. Oh no! Oh yes, I know all your dirty little secrets. And I've been writing them down in my little book. That's what I do. You kill things, I take notes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Thumbs up. Okay, so he's like, uh, your stats. This seems like the kind of game you would love. Yeah. I'm big in the roguelikes. I think Returnal was my favorite. Right, yeah, that shooter one? Mm -hmm. That one was really good. This door's not open. I hear Hades is really good. Already getting hit. <laughs> I thought about picking up bed cells when I first saw it, but I just really never got around to it. <laughs> I stunned him by breaking the door on <laughs> him. Yeah, that's what I was doing. I would kind of wait until they were by the door and then kick it in. The only thing I don't like about these games is how luck-based they are. Yeah. It's kind of the appeal of them, though, like a uh, replayability. Ah, dang it. I just dodge. It's a uh, circle. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I can... Oh! Yeah, that seems like it's way easier than the shield. Plus it keeps you going. Yeah. You keep your momentum. Now, I don't know how that's going to be four or five worlds from now if there's like ten enemies in a room. Shield might be worth practicing. <laughs> Sixty-five percent, seventy percent. Okay, so it looks like they each have their own things. Uh, I'd still think it's worth taking the tactics later on. You do not have a thing for just for fifty health. Uh, I'll just take the big health bump for now. It just feels like a 2D Dark Souls, like you use the same strategies and stuff. Yeah. Like, I bet that bow and arrow isn't meant to damage, but more to pull attention. Right. Just kind of drag things over one by one. That's pretty much what they do in Dark Souls. Yeah. I made it under two minutes. I'm in a new area. Yeah, so I get to open it up. Uh oh. I don't know what's in here, but. Bonus. Yay! 
What's this? That's a lot of the dead cells. Excellent. What's up there? Back to entrance. Ooh, ooh. That's a really good bow. That bow's stronger than your sword. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Jeez, so it really is worth, like, not exploring the <laughs> you gotta first hustle. Area. You gotta get through there. Blueprint for Frenzy. Okay, so I get to pick one or the other, right? So this... Pick two, or pick one, rather. So you don't even, uh... Shouldn't even explore the first area. You should just go. And if you do explore, stop and kill 30 enemies so you can open this one. Without getting hit. Yeah, because you got the, uh... You got a kill count today, so I got 10 of them. So either book it or get the kills. I'd rather book it. I don't know if I can do 30 without getting hit. I can't afford anything outright from the looks of it. What is that bottom one? Uh, it's a mutation for Frenzy. One of the perks. Melee attacks for a small amount of HT. Oh, that would go great with that sword I was using. Go and dump into this, I guess. That's the thing, though, is that's very, uh, you have to have the right thing for it. Yeah, but. Yeah, I can't afford anything else at the time, at the moment, rather. I don't think I'm just going to get that combo thing. Ooh, like that. Oh, oh. No. I was going to say that third one on tra tactics because you just got that really good bow. Oh, yeah. I would get that next. So you'll be from like 400 something damage to like 500 damage. Okay, and then. Oh, they can like come back to me. I wonder if they deal damage on the way back. And they do what? Is it bleeding or burning? Uh, I can't remember. Let's take a look here. The sewers! Uh, I remember there was a button to look at my things. What was it? Was it the touchpad? That yeah, brings up the map. Uh, whoa. Okay, we've got like branching padding too. Nah, here we go. Burning. It was, uh, it was start. So that'll probably hurt you, I would imagine. A grid liquid. Yeah, that's... <laughs> I'm trying to... Hey, you! Come here a second. Oh, a little slow. You seem to understand what I'm saying. I lost a, uh, I mean my room. So you see, I'm a little stuck. And I need my room, you see. You wouldn't mind finding it for me, would you? You got it, dude. <laughs> Thank you. It's somewhere around here in these sewers, on your side of these bars. Bring it back to me quick. Sure thing, random big guy. Holy <laughs> moly. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Well, I'm picking tactics on my next level up. Oops, <laughs> wrong Next time, try shooting one and see if it hurts on coming back. Oh, yeah. Still waiting on them. Oh, they're stuck inside of them. Oh, uh, are they like burning them over time? It didn't look like it. What does it say? Oh, okay. It does bonus damage to somebody who is burning. Gotcha. So it just stacks damage. Yeah. That's ridiculous. Oh. Yeah, this is... <laughs> it's gotta hustle on that first stage. No. Oh my gosh. Oh, I can even crouch and, like, get it lower for its small enemies. Now I can just get a really good sword you're set. Yeah. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, can't shoot through that. Alright, hold on. I gotta... I just hard counter these archery guys though, because I can just like crouch beneath theirs.
Oh, those bombs. Can you shoot midair? Probably. Okay, I, I gotta get out of there. Okay, if I jump, he wants to latch on to the... He wants to mantle up there. Let me just... Nope. Let's just... I can. <clears throat> so broken. It really is. Yeah, I should carry you through a world or two. Yeah. Well, we know for sure you you want to get through that first level, because I barely made it through that. I, I was like four seconds on time. On climb the pipe. Leave me alone. Okay. I just have to not mess up. That looks good. That new blue tequila place in Somerville. I've not heard of it. It's a new Mexican place. Yeah, it does look good. I saw it last time I was there. Like, I think it's where the uh, Sticky Fingers was. Oh, up by um, Azalea? Yeah. on that. Okay. Like, okay. It looked like a door. Uh, you gotta go far left. Yeah, I see something over there. Ah, yep, there are the enemies. Oh, yeah, she... here. That was like a legendary from Borderlands or something. Ah, oh, he's just too short. Secret. Oh! 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 I didn't even do anything to discover that secret. I just hit the wall and it was like. <laughs> Me that tactic damage <laughs> if I need it. Message. Keep this door locked at all costs. If the rats get out and we'll spread them alive. The, the malaise. Rats are always a prime suspect in times of illness. I don't know. I kind of like rats. <laughs> I'd be surprised if it was rats that made a hole like that. It looked solid before it was broken down. seems to keep shaking more. I guess I need a, another upgrade before I can break those. They're probably like a heavier slam. Yeah. Ice grenade. 
Electric Whip 3. So this is another tactics weapon. More shields. I guess we'll replace the sword with this. Plus you get the uh, other thing with it. 16%. Oh yeah, my perk. This one doesn't kill me. Oh, nope, get me out of here! Extra health from brutality saved me. <laughs> Ooh, this looks that important. looks like a trap. <laughs> no, I'm at 30 health. <laughs> I'm going for it. Oh, frost blast four. Freezes enemies in front of you. No damage if the target is already frozen. You know what? I'm going to take that as a defensive option there and replace the whip. That way, if I start getting overrun, I can just kind of panic button that. Because you're using the support. Yeah. Yeah, I was using it on the guys I like jump forward and stuff whenever I can't get over them. So, yeah, I can probably use that. I found a door. The door don't open. Bob, I need that help. So you can jump out of a roll in the air, but it doesn't seem that useful. That's just so strong. No, get all the acid. Okay. You're back in the beginning. Oh. No, I don't think so. This guy. I got tons of cash right now. Tonic four and tonic five. There is a toxic cloud around you. Infantry grenade. Wolf trap. Tonic um, cloud seems good. Do what? So that tonic one seems good just because like if you're getting surrounded you can poison them and you get your health back. Well this was the uh, the overshield thing. And freezes nearby enemies when it's so yeah. Bad. That's gonna be our panic button. Yeah, I wonder. You may as well take it. Wish you luck. Oh, he gave me a pen. The Vor pen. Just want to see what it does. <laughs> it does more DPS. Yeah, and I have to freeze from the uh, the thing. I'm dripping blood right now. Yeah, I'm, I think I'll actually take this. What was that other one you could afford? Uh, it was the grenade or the trap, and then he gave me the pan. Uh -huh. You don't want the grenade? Uh, it takes the slot of the um, uh -huh. the tonic. So I think I'll use the tonic as my panic button. I thought it would go on your L2. No, I think you had something in the L2. I don't know, I had the money, I may as well check and see. 
reason not to. Because they both light up, yeah. Oh, okay. Cool. So that could be used against, like, a boss or something if you find one. It's a long area. <laughs> Bludgeon something with a pan. Yeah, now that I have a, what were they called, one of the red weapons? Now that I have one of those, I'm able to take advantage of that perk again. You have 42 cells. Yeah. I'm, I'm hoping the end is near here, because I don't want to lose these. We've got that quite a lot. Oops. I want, like, slow down for a second. I wonder what that was about. Oh! <laughs> it's probably worse than what you got. Yeah, it looks the same. Mechanism is keeping the door locked. Reminds me of Donkey Kong when you get to the end, it's like a lit up cave. Oh, yeah. There's a little sign, too, isn't there? Yeah, it's like a wooden plank. Look who's here. Alright. What is this? Recover health after parrying? Maybe. <clears throat> no, I'm a believer in the bow now. <laughs> I may as well top off this. attacks for a small amount of HP depending on the attack damage as long as you have an active speed buff. Okay, so yeah, I can, I can see that. Uh, well, then we'll just dump into Health Flash 2, I guess. Oh, you can heal twice. That's going to be very helpful later. Yes. <laughs> I'm usually near an enemy. Oh, I could get this now. Skillful dice. I'm gonna get Hunter's Instinct. I can't not know. Yeah, I'll just jump in. I was gonna say if you said anything different. <laughs> Heal up. And onward to the records. The guards would perch themselves on the ramparts at the first sign of the Malays. Like having like the bow and moving all around like a ninja, I feel so smooth. And then I just whip out the frying pan and just bludgeon him. <laughs> only fire the bow left and right. I'm just going to drop like this. Nice. <laughs> There's 
another one over there. Let this guy turn around. Oof. I don't know if I got a crit or something, but I hit him at the end of that combo. The new guy at the bottom there. He's the one I jumped on his head. Like every time you, every now and then you'll hit them, they'll like slow down. The time will slow down. It's weird. So I'm gonna wanna keep a melee weapon on me for the thing. With the bow. Nutcracker 4. It's a critical hit if they're stunned, frozen, or rooted. Victims slow down all nearby enemies when they die. Cannot be interrupted by an enemy's attack. Oh man! Yeah, that's big. Some range. It's one of the vitality things, the green items. Oh, you can roll in here. Alright, looks like I can. Part of me wants to jump down this. <laughs> the rest of me feels like that's a bad idea, but it looks like. I don't know. I'm not gonna attempt fate. Maybe if I was more experienced and felt like I could get back here easily, <laughs> but, uh, I don't. I don't feel like throwing it away for curiosity. It looks like I can go up. The next slide is just beautiful. I love it. So these have like a, like a cooldown. Yeah, I think those are the skill cooldowns it's talking about. Yeah, okay, so I have the shield on now. Okay. See so yeah, how when the shield breaks, it goes on that cooldown. Okay, I understand. Very cool. Uh, I'm gonna take the health. And having a, a larger weapon would. There we go. 
looks like rolling through them is going to be the best bet. I had a feeling, and then I saw the the symbol. <laughs> I was gonna start randomly slashing at walls or something. some kind. Also really like how kind of the ambient wind <laughs> that's on the stages. Like how my cape, like my scarf kind of like flows. Yeah. <laughs> Live target training. <laughs> the supply of bows and arrows. Hmm. Ooh. Electric with three. I'm gonna keep my hammer. Only one arrow hit the target. Right in the head. <laughs> There's the 50. <laughs> There's like 30 more here. The prison's archers are really useless. There's a purple room under there. Do you remember what purple was on the map? No. Have we seen a purple room yet? Uh, oh, that, no. that screams boss dungeon. Yeah, that, that's a boss for sure. Maybe not. It might be like a vendor. Maybe. I don't know. When I see big rooms that you kind of fall into, I'm thinking boss. Oh, no, it's the vendor guy. You were right. Covers the ground around you with flammable oil, freezes enemies. Upgrade your grenade with sinew slicer. Carry spinning blades in nearby enemies with looking bleeding. Spreads flammable oil, drops your grenade when destroyed. Generates toxic cloud. I feel like this will synergize with my. Uh, my bow a little bit. Might be able to get the fire going. The grenade, maybe. At the same time, if you uh, fight somebody who has damage resistance against fire, then you should have a back door. I still have the hammer, and uh, the bow deals neutral damage. It just deals bonus damage against people on fire. So yeah, even then, if somebody's resistant to fire, I still get the bonus damage on the bow, so... Much needed health. I don't even like being under half of this game right now. Oh man! Can I just pin him down forever? I think it is. It's like a turret. Oh, they're working together. They're learning. Ooh. Okay, yeah, I really like that. It 
So I can kind of like put it there, dodge through him. <laughs> Maybe. You were away, I came into possession of the sinew slicer. It's this guy here on the ground. I throw him out in this little barrel. He's like a little turret. It's only a 10 second cooldown? Yeah. That's he's, crazy. He's good too. He's strong. Yeah, I read what he did. It's insane. Like when I like when I read it, it says fire spinning blades at nearby enemies, I interpreted that as me throwing something. No. Not a turret that does it. Yeah. But he's really cool. He's like uh What's the uh, link? Uh, I have to be near him. Oh. So if I'm not near him, then uh, you can you might be able to see it. There's a little like zero power sign above him. Yeah. So I got I can't just set him and forget him. But uh, there's a shield guy before. I was able to get behind him, throw that, and then stand on the other side of him and help him with arrows. <clears throat> so no matter which way he was blocking, he was taking damage. What's really going to be nice is if you fight a boss and you kind of get to where all you want to do is evade, you can just sort that down and let yeah. it do the work. Let's try and set it in the middle so I can try and stay near it. I'm hoping the end is near because I'm... Ah! Up. There it is! Because <laughs> I was... I was hoping for some health there. I'm wanting more of this. Can I just hold it down? Work, please. Okay, so I'm not really getting anything out of that with my current setup. That might be worth it. Like a little more than half a second. Yeah, because it's only 30 seconds for my thing, for my, uh, for the shot. So, yeah, I'm not using shield. I'm gonna probably, I think I'm liking this setup here. With the bow and the thing, and the melee weapon of some kind. So, instead of 30 seconds, it would be 29.44 seconds. Well, that's on every enemy I kill with the bow. Ah, I see. So, getting it back even like five seconds faster, because it, it gives a good chunk of my health. Yeah. As, like, overshield, so I think this will be pretty valuable. Because, yeah, I basically get a free 50% health while I've got that on. Like, you can... But, like, all that blue is free health. Unfortunately, I can't cool it down while I have the shield up, but, uh... That's what it is. It's a lot of health. Yeah. I wonder if there's a max. Probably. There, it might be kind of like a soft cap, where like everything's giving you like plus one percent health. So like, it, ooh, this is nice. It's kind of hard to look at with the glow. I love it, especially like the pink to the blue fade on the water and the the rippling. I think it's pretty. It's just that moon is distracting. Oh, boss fight! All right, the concierge. Come on! I'm out of ammo. Right, oh I'm man. Out. Okay. Stuck in this thing. Uh, you can't. Okay. 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 I don't think I should 
I hate you. Oh man. Oh. I'm I'm choking now. I'm not I'm not paying attention now. Oh man, I do not like that hurt. Remember the thing about uh, wanting to focus on evading and letting the turret do the job? <laughs> I was doing good there. Where are we at? <laughs> the beginning. <laughs> well, we may as well uh, stop this one, and then I'll start mine on the next one. Sounds good.